Alright, what's up guys? We're gonna uh we're gonna plow the driveway with the uh, 1023 e John Deere tractor. Uh I'm not gonna be able to pick up as much as I want to because I didn't have the bucket face down, so it's a little bit of ice in there. But basically what you want to start off doing when you're doing the uh when you're using this tractor is you find your wall and you back drag from the wall and you have to go a pretty good distance out because the John Deere tractor is so long. Back drag as much as you can. Then when you start doing the driveway, the plow doesn't, th this is not a plow, it's a bucket. So when you start plowing, the snow goes in both directions. So what I like to do is I like to go down the middle of the driveway, get that cleared out and then hit it in half sections. So if, when I do lose snow, I lose it to one side and then at the end, you're still gonna lose it to one, on both sides, but not as much and at the end, you'll just uh, drive and fix it up. So.
to make the driveway a little bit wider, but that's basically the gist of it. I gotta, I gotta go out a little bit here and I'll go out a little bit there, but as you can see, you can get a plow, but uh, I don't see how a thousand, fifteen hundred dollar plow is gonna, you know, a couple extra trips down the driveway is worth it. So there you go. And by the way, uh, normally I go on low, but for the sake of the video, I went ahead and kept it on high because I know people are gonna comment about that. But uh, yeah, there you go. Plow with a 1023 or you know a 1025 tractor using a bucket.